guys, so today I'm back with another planner update. This is the current week. It is Saturday right now. That is the kitten. All right. He does not have manners yet uh, when it comes to filming. He thinks he's little enough that he just can do whatever he wants. And that includes walking all over my stuff as I try to film. He is the cutest little thing. <laughs> the cutest little thing ever. Okay, go bye-bye. I can't even, I don't even want to move him. Okay, back to this. It is Saturday right now. That's why Sunday is not filled out. I'm filming this early because Andrea from Scribble Prints Co., which you guys might recognize because she makes all of these stickers or most of these stickers, is coming to visit me in LA on Sunday and she's leaving Wednesday. So I'm going ahead and pre-filming my videos. I'm gonna put this one up Sunday and I'm gonna put a plan with me, which I've already filmed for next week up on Monday. And last planner update, I gave you guys like a little sneak peek of the week that I planned the following week. But this time, you'll just have to wait for the video. It's secret. So this was the current week that we're on right now. This was Scribble Prints Co's Bring Back the Floral Kit or Bring Back the May Box or something. I don't remember what the name of it was, but it basically was a collection that she had in her mystery box back in May, which people loved. And I never got my hands on the original one. And so I was really glad that she brought it back. And she brought it back because of popular demand. So. That is what I did. I pretty much had a pretty boring week, to be perfectly honest. My mom was in town over the weekend and Monday, so that was really fun. But then she left Tuesday, and I pretty much just like worked and like kind of just didn't, I wasn't super productive this week, let's say. I did put up lots of videos. I put up a video there, a video there, a video there. And then a video there. Oh, and a video there. Yeah, okay, so <laughs> I say I wasn't very productive, but I actually got a lot done. I just, I don't know, looking back on this week, I feel like I didn't get very much done. I'm not really sure. I did start my wedding diet, that's new. Um, I talk about that a little bit in my plan with me, but I have wedding diet stickers. I didn't start it until Wednesday, so the first two days were fails, but I went ahead and put them in so that it evened everything out. The week before that was this week. This was Scribble Prince Co's September kit along with this rose kit from Vintage Gypsy Road. I think it was her September kit. This was the collection sheet. It was really, really pretty. Um, I used a couple stickers off this and then I used all of her glossy full square boxes instead of doing one of Scribble Prince's patterned themes as I normally do. I decided to do something a little different and did it from Vintage Gypsy Road, which is another shop that I absolutely love. And her little planners are just the cutest things in the entire world. I loved that. And I used a bunch of these guys here and some of her icons. So that definitely came in handy. And this week, actually, I was very, very busy. So that might be why I felt like this week was kind of like, a, oh, I don't really know what I did, even though I actually did a lot looking back on it. But this week, I actually was really busy to the point of not even finishing my planner. Look, I didn't do anything on the bottom and I didn't do anything on the side until like halfway through the week. I just finally was like, I don't even have time to plan, so I just did it all in pen, and it looks fine, but like looking at this week, I know that I didn't finish it the way like this week looks like. What is the cat doing? Oh my goodness, pinecone. The baby has this like toy that makes a lot of noise, and so he was playing with it as I was filming the plan with me, and I was like, you can't do that because it's gonna be really obnoxious on the video. So I put it up on the counter, and now pinecone's on top of it playing with it. I don't even remember what I was saying, but this week was really busy. I filmed a lot of videos. I didn't put up a lot of videos, and that might have been why I put so many up this week, but I filmed a lot and kind of like got everything ready for the following week. I also picked up the new baby kitten, which you saw a second ago. He is the cutest, and I announced him on Saturday. We had him for a few days before announcing him. I started looking at wedding venues, and my mom came into town. Friday or Saturday, and then I announced the baby cat on Saturday. Oh my gosh, do you hear that? Pine cone. <laughs> oh my god. Pine cone. I put it up there for a reason so you cats would leave it alone while I was filming. Overall, I really like the way both of these spreads turned out. This was very different than what I would typically be attracted to, but it was a nice like change of pace because my spreads have been either kind of dark or very pink. And then this one is like one of my all time favorites. Like this is top 
five spreads that I've ever done. I love this collection. I know it's kind of like frantic and crazy and there's stuff going on everywhere, especially with these stickers up at the top, but I just loved it. I love these colors. I think they're so summery and they made me really, really happy. So I also have two sticker hauls for you guys today from Willow Fields and Sweet Quiet Design. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys these. So this one is from Willow Fields. There's a card on top from her, but I will not read that out loud. And then let me show you these stickers. Let me zoom you guys in so you can see a little bit better. These first Galaxy stickers I'm obsessed with. I think these are so cool. I feel like I need to figure out how to do a spread with this. I just think they're the coolest. I definitely thought these were burgers. They are definitely macarons. They are not burgers, but I definitely thought they were, and I also did not think that was weird. These match with it. Really cute collection kit page. What, Pinecomb? Some more stickers that match the collection. Some balloons. I love this. Balloons and clouds. These are really, really pretty. I love hot air balloons. This collection is a color that's right up my alley. I think these are so pretty. Then you have this one that would have worked really well in July. These colors are really pretty with the collection kit, the cats are chasing each other. They are just not settled down today. This is my favorite one that I've seen so far. I love that. It's Parisian, it has flowers, it's the color scheme that I love. It says bonjour with little bikes. This is definitely like going to be used. This would be pretty in September because of the grays also, because there's gray in it. And then this is the little collection kit that goes with it. And then this is another one that I love. Wow, these color collections are really good. Love this one. I love the birds. I love the colors of the navy and the pink and the blue with the collection kit as well. And then this one has different like primary color type flowers. These look like the little ones you blow in the wind with the collection kit. That was everything from Willow Fields. I definitely love, love, love both the bird one. That is so cute. And also the Parisian one which is here. I definitely love these. I think they would both work for September, especially this gray one. I'm obsessed with it. That is gorgeous. I will have her shop linked below. She makes really cute stickers. I love her. The next shop is Sweet Kawaii Design, which is a shop that I have shown before. I've shown Willow Fields before also. I love Sweet Kawaii Designs. She is so cute. I'll show you these first. So she made all of her stickers on pages and also she made mini versions, which are what these are, which are really cute. So there's the mini pinecone cats, his and her pinecone cats, mini iPhones, really cute. I actually used one of these in my plan with me spread for next week. Little mini targets with cute little eyeballs. That's my favorite part little workout flags, little laundry, washing machines, trash cans, tacos, if you're doing a taco night or going to a taco truck, little adorable grocery carts. This is one of my favorite things that she makes. It's literally grocery carts with like little bows. I'm obsessed, I think they're so cute. Little popcorns, little pills. This is like a household bundle. It has light bulbs, laptop, iPhone, trash can, and house mini makeup brush for when you need to clean your makeup brushes. Coffees with little like creams with faces. That is so cute. Look, the cream has a little bow. That is the cutest thing ever. Little suitcases or gym bags, food bundles. Now that is a burger. So the other one was not, but that is a burger. This is a fall one with corn, pumpkin pie, and acorn, and two kinds of leaves, all with faces. Super cute for the months coming up. These are weights. Crock pots, credit cards, cameras. I've been waiting for her to design a really cute small camera icon like this for when I need to shoot videos, so I really like that. Book stacks for glitter days. Alarm clocks, water bottles to track how much hydration you're drinking. You can like check off as you go with your cups of water. These are bigger fall ones with a couple of full square boxes. Love these little pillows with time to relax. I love that for days where you just kind of need to chill out and veg and decompress. Some more fall ones. I love this cornucopia in the middle. Very cute and a little turkey. Oh my gosh, I love this sheet. I cannot wait to use this sheet. This is so cute. And then the last one is a blogger one. It says blog and time to blog with a laptop. Super cute. I also got sent her September kit. Now, I don't know what the deal is with these monthly kits. I don't know if it's a subscription series or if you just go on her shop and get them every month. I'm not really sure, but I will link her shop below. 
and I will show you what's in September's. So this is a little mini Labor Day sheet with your basics for Labor Day for doing a cookout. These are some workout ones with, and these are all in the September colors, so purple and gray. Some hydrate bottles, weekly weigh-ins, weights, shoes. These you can put in your sidebar or they would fit in the boxes. Some heart flags and some dots down here that you can make checklists with. A fall one because you know September is getting into fall. Welcome autumn because the first day of fall is in September. This is like a collection sheet with a ton of different things that you would use including some money stacks which are good for days when you get paid or when you need to go to the bank and deposit some money. And then some of these for the bottom area of your planner where I put in my little custom stickers. You could use these. So really cute kit with pretty much everything you would need in terms of the functional stickers you would need. Thank you so much both of these shops for sending me stickers. You guys are the best. I really, really appreciate it. And I get very excited when I get new stickers. Yeah, I think that's everything. I didn't have a whole lot to talk about in this planner update, but I did want to show you two weeks of spreads because I should have done a planner update in between these two weeks, but I didn't because my mom was in town over the weekend and then we got a cat and it's just been a little bit crazy. So I hope you guys enjoyed this planner update. Make sure to subscribe for more planner videos and I will link my planner playlist below as always and I will see you guys with my next video. Tomorrow will be my plan with me so go ahead and write it in your planner to watch my plan with me video tomorrow and I will see you guys later. Bye!